Yeah, we do a disservice to ourselves, and I, and, mm. I, and I'm being honest with you because if you look at even the scholarly traditions mm. amongst uh, in in other in other settings, they don't behave like that. You know, they have more calm, more composure, yeah. more sense of you know we have to e- evaluate what's happening. You know, and yeah. we shouldn't be so quick to react. At another even person. in our own tradition, earlier on, you know, before modernity, before that's right, social that's media, right, that's right. Ibn Qayyim said such an amazing quote. He said. Zalatul ulama aqdar wa hum bihar. You know, mm-hmm. he said the mistakes of scholars are like, you know, pieces of dirt whilst they are oceans. Yeah. And even. <laughs> and you know, when water reaches a particular amount, then, you know, a, a, an impurity doesn't affect it. Allah Akbar. And mm-hmm. even the word zal, the word zal, in fact, isn't mis- it means a slip. Yeah. The word mm-hmm. zal means a slip. And the word zal, look how it's used in the Quran. I mean, this is mm-hmm. p- powerful because this is what. You know, I'll, uh, when I'll, Adam yeah, that's it. Shaitan, yeah. Shaitan, yeah. Uh, 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 there's no grand, great fall that necessitates a savior coming to redeem you because Adam just slipped. <laughs> it's, it's, it's not. Yeah. It's, it's only a slip, a stumble, yeah. you know. And then Allah helped him up because of Fatalaka Adam, mm-hmm. and Allah, you know, inspired Adam with the words to say to make toba. Now look at this narration of Omar. In Umar's Khilafah, there was a man who was uh, got involved in a major sin, okay, and mm. he w- became shamed, you know, and, and so he went away from the masjid, he kind of kept himself in some, he's, he's doing his major sin. And Umar once asked, where is that man that we used to see in the masjid, where is he gone? And, and they said, oh, he's doing this major sin now, and so this is why he doesn't come back. And Umar says to call somebody who can write, and we'll write a letter to the man and we'll send it to him. And and Umar just wrote one, he says, number one, min Umar ibn Khattab, not like min Amir al-Mu'mineen, mm-hmm. this is a man to man, we're all human beings, we're all in this together, ila fulan ibn fulan, to you. One verse in the Quran, Surah Al-Ghafir, Allah is, ghafir dhan, wuqabila tawb, shadid al-iqab, dhat tawl, la ilaha illahu ilaha al-masir. That's it, one ayah, stamp it, send it, seal it, send it. Allah is saying Allah is a forgiver of sins, Allah is an acceptor of repentance, Allah is severe in punishment, mm. Allah's blessings are endless and everything goes back to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. There's no God except Him, no one worship, deserves worship except Him and Allah's blessings are and, and everything goes back to Allah. And then after a while Umar asked what has happened to that man that you know, we, was, we were worried about, we sent him, mm. and, and they said he's back with us, back with us, mm. you know. And mm. Umar said this to me, he says, he said, he, looks, he said, هَكَذَا فَصْنَعُوا إِذَا رَأَيْتُمْ أَخٍ لَكُمْ زَلَّ زَلَّةً وَلَا تَكُونُوا أَعْوَانَ لِشَيْطَانِ عَلَيْهِ This is how you behave if you see one of your brothers slip and don't be shaitan supporter against him.